The S-500 Promity, Prometheus, is a new long-range anti-aircraft and anti-ballistic missile system that was recently developed in Russia. It can be seen as an advanced version of the S-400. Its development commenced in 2002. It was developed by Almazanti Corporation. This system was also referred as the Triumphator M. Prototype testing was expected to begin in 2015. Initial production of the S-500 reportedly commenced in 2017. In 2019 another reports confirmed that initial production of the S-500 began. Originally this system was planned to be fielded in 2020. However the project was dragging behind schedule. In 2019 it was announced that early testing of this air defense system will start in 2020. In 2021 a footage was revealed where the S-500 successfully engaged a high-speed ballistic missile. During the same year some Russian military officials reported that official testing of this system was completed. First S-500 systems were fielded in 2021. It was announced that second batch of these systems will be fielded in 2022. These are pre-production systems that still need to be tested and improved. First S-500 systems were deployed around Moscow. These will protect Moscow and surrounding areas against ballistic missile attacks. In 2022 it was announced that mass production of the S-500 system began. Russia plans to field 10 battalions of S-500 missiles within the next couple of years. The S-500 is not an upgrade of the S-400, but rather a new design. It uses a lot of new technology and is superior to the S-400. It was designed to intercept ballistic missiles. It was planned to have a range of 500 to 600 kilometers and hit targets at altitudes as high as 40 kilometers. Some sources claim that this system is capable of tracking 5 to 20 ballistic targets and intercepting up to 5 to 10 ballistic targets simultaneously. It can defeat ballistic missiles traveling at a speed of 5 to 7 kilometers per second. It has been reported that this air defense system can also target low orbital satellites. It is planned that the S-500 will shield Moscow and the regions around it. It will replace the current A-135 anti-ballistic missile system. The S-500 missiles will be used only against the most important targets, such as intercontinental ballistic missiles, AWACS, and jamming aircraft. The S-500 will carry various missiles. These missiles will have various ranges and will be used against different targets. In 2009 a 40N6 long-range air defense missile was ready for testing. In 2021 another missile, which could be the 77N6, was launched during testing against a high-speed ballistic missile. Some sources report that the S-500 system can detect ballistic missile at a range of 2,000 km and warheads of ballistic missiles at a range of 1-300 km. This system can defeat ballistic missiles before their warheads re-enter atmosphere. This system has brief reaction time. It has been reported that the S-500 can launch missiles within 10 minutes from traveling. Also it can be considered as a survivable system, as after launching its missiles it can briefly redeploy. In the 1980s Soviets already used this shoot, scoot and hide philosophy on the S-300V air defense system. The S-500 missiles are mobile. All equipment will be carried by heavy high mobility trucks. The launcher vehicle with missiles is referred as 55P6. It is based on a BAZ-690960 heavy high mobility chassis with 10x10 configuration. Two command posts were planned to be based on BAZ-69092-126 by 6 trucks. Acquisition and battle management radar was planned to be towed by a BAZ-6403.018 by 8 tractor truck. Another acquisition radar was planned to be mounted on the BAZ-690960 by 10 chassis. A multi-mode engagement radar was planned to be mounted on the BAZ-6909-022 8x8 truck. The anti-ballistic missile engagement radar is planned to be mounted on the BAZ-69096 chassis with 10x10 configuration. 
all of these vehicles have good cross-country mobility and can operate off-road.